Um, why do I have trouble getting stuff out of boxes? Or then it can just fall right out. Hi everyone, I'm Wigo Warrior, aka Julie. And welcome back to my channel. If you are new, welcome. Wigo stands for when you get old. I am 54 years old. But love and enjoy makeup, skincare, doing product reviews, beauty hauls, and unboxing videos. If you've stopped by because you're curious what you can get in the Party Pout 3 for 20 wondrous 7th anniversary sale from Gerard Cosmetics, then you're in the right place and keep on watching. All right, first off, apologies. I didn't find out about this sale until like literally March 30th and I think it ended on March 31st so by the time this is uploaded to YouTube I bet this deal is over but I'm still gonna do the um, unboxing and try on of the products so that hopefully next year you can sign up um, and once you sign up with Gerard Cosmetics I ain't gonna lie they spam you with um, emails but they have a lot of a lot of sales and specials so never buy anything full price always look out for a sale all right so this fantastic offer I actually did last year and I'm embarrassed I don't even know if I want to do it but there's a video link above from a year ago when I was very new to YouTube the lighting was crap my rate of speech was crap. It was a really bad video. But if you're curious about the products, you can check that out. So, Gerard Cosmetics Liquid Lipstick by itself retails for $20. So, this deal was just mind-blowing because for the same $20, you got to select your own color, which, whichever one you wanted, a liquid lipstick a bullet lipstick which retails for $19 and a lip liner which retails for $16 20 bucks three products no-brainer uh, what reminded me also was I was seeing some unboxings about some mystery bags for $29 and typically it was like a setting spray which I already have from Gerard Cosmetics love it the coconut one and then they were getting lip products with random color stories, which may or may not have gone with their skin tone or what they typically wear. So I'm like, $20, I actually get to pick the shade that I want and the color. Oh. All right. And then, of course, because I hate paying for shipping and handling, um, I ended up spending more money in order to reach the cap for free shipping. Because why not? Anyways, with all my rambling, let's dig in, open the bag, and see what I got. Nothing sexy, just a mailer. So I was, I always, when I want my free shipping, try to keep it as close to the minimum to qualify. I was like, oh, one product put me way over. Anyways, I went to their sale page. I picked up one of those. I don't even know what it's called. I am so freaking old. It's the little popper stopper thing that goes on the back of a cell phone and that you can, oh, I don't know, comment, let me know. I got one of those. It was like five bucks. I also selected a lipstick that was on sale for $5 in the shade London Fog. So fingers crossed it wasn't $5 because it's, Barbie doll pink or something really obnoxious. The color shades online never, ever uh, are what I picture them to be in my head. So we shall see. Oh, okay. Not Barbie doll pink. Very dark. Purple mauve. Mm. Okay, I'm going to set this aside. Now, on to the actual items I selected. So I selected a lip liner in the shade Nude Lip Pencil, Lip Liner. Do you guys refer to it as a lip liner or lip pencil? 
I think I usually say lip pencil unless I'm filming YouTube and forget and then call it a lip liner. Um, why do I have trouble getting stuff out of boxes? Or then it can just fall right out. All right, so this, if you've never seen Gerard Cosmetics packaging, it's usually very gold, shiny. There's the color. That's what it looks like there. There is a swatch. And now, time to put it on my face, in case you were wondering, not wearing any lip products, because I knew I'd be doing a try on. Very creamy, very nice. I have tried their lip products before, which are lovely. Okay, lip pencil in nude. One item for $20. The next item I selected was a liquid lipstick in the shade Soho. Here's what this packaging looks like. Pretty standard doe foot. It has a slight metallic sheen, which I actually enjoy. I know not everyone likes having a metallic sheen. It's kind of a pinky, rose, mauve color, which I love. I don't know how well it will pair with the nude lip pencil, but we shall find out. I'm loving this color. Not super jiving with the lip pencil, just color wise. Um, the pencil is kind of more terracotta orangey, not orange, but warmer. And this is more cooler tone. One's more pink, one's more orange. But it feels nice. It is. It feels like a matte. It is kind of matte, even though it's kind of metallic shimmery. Okay. Now, on to the third item, which was a lip gloss that I selected in the shade Buttercream. Ooh, very nice packaging. You get the gold, and then there's an actual mirror here, if I were to peel this off. And... I think this is going to light up. Yes! That is spectacular. $20 for all three of these items. I know, right? This comes with a very tiny doe foot and is very soft pink. Lighter pink than I was anticipating. If I were to name it, I would call it like ballet slipper. Um, but there you go. Again, it may not bode well on top of here, but I'm just going to throw it on so you can see it firsthand. And maybe it will go well with the on top of the uh, liquid lipstick shade. I am not used to having a light <laughs> in my face. But that would be nice like when you're in the car and it's dark and you need to reapply. All right, what are your thoughts? This lip gloss, it's not sticky per se, but it's thick, if that makes sense. So some may perceive it as sticky-ish, but not the stickiest, not like a lip oil where it's super smoothing but um, I would call it thick if that makes sense okay one last item I got not related to the 3 for 20 deal but so that I could hit free shipping and I've been on the hunt for some, a product similar to this for a while and I've heard some good things about it 
and that is this little guy here which is way smaller than it looked online this is the clean canvas in fair which is an eyeshadow primer oh little baby guy little baby guy here I'm telling you the um, ooh, and that if that's fair that's darker than what I would consider fair I'm sure it will be fine Honestly, I thought that the clean canvas would be closer to this size and not this size. Um, it is way smaller than I thought. And for $22, uh, if I knew it was this small, I'm sure I would have decided on another product. Hopefully it's good. Let me swatch it because I now own it. But she be pricey. Honestly, it looks and acts like foundation. Um, somebody let me know if you've used this product before and please assure me that it's fantastic. I will not regret spending $22, but after looking at it in my hand, it just looks like a thick, full coverage foundation. And I spent $22 for like 1.2 grams or something. How, how much product do you get here? four grams. All right, so let's recap something I paid for myself and am questioning my own shopping abilities. So first off, yay to three lip products for $20, particularly when a lipstick alone costs $20. So it's like buy a lipstick, get a lip liner and lip gloss for free. You cannot beat a deal like that. Spectacular, right? Now, to get my free shipping, I also bought a very expensive um, eye primer at $22. I picked up from their sale page a lipstick for $5. And for $5, a doohickey mabob that goes on the back of a cell phone. Too old to know what that's called. I spent a grand total of $51.98. Let me know what you think of my purchase. Um, do you feel the same as I do about how tiny this is? Um, lesson learned. Hopefully I hate it so I don't have to buy it again because she's pricey. Um, I am excited about these lip products. Let me know your thoughts. Probably not the similar color that you would enjoy. But, um, yeah. So, shopping online, not always fun. Pictures of lip products, not always easy to match. But, I got three for 20 bucks, so I feel good. All right, don't forget to um, check out the 500 subscriber giveaway video. It's two minutes long, all the information on what you need to do to participate is there. For those who already are subscribed, thank you. I appreciate you. Um, don't forget to hit that little, little, little thumbs up button. It really helps with the algorithm. And then click the um, bell notification so that you are reminded when I next post a video. All right, thanks everyone.